Robert Rocky Balboa is a ham and egger southpaw from Philadelphia who spends his nights getting clobbered in clubs for chump change and his spare time trying to court the attention of Adrian at the pet store, much to the chagrin of a bully of a brother, Paulie. When heavyweight world champ Apollo Creed loses his opponent five weeks out from his big bicentennial fight in Philadelphia, he proposes they give a title shot to a local fighter. Creed chooses Rocky based purely on his nickname, the Italian Stallion. Rocky prepares for the fight with the help of trainer Mick Goldmill, a few slabs of meat, and enough eggs to give the Easter Bunny an aneurysm. Oh, and the greatest training song in the history of music. Despite Apollo's confidence, Rocky knocks him down in the first round and it becomes all-out war in the ring for 15 rounds. Got him, Mitch. Rocky ultimately goes the distance against the champ in a fight that silences his critics. He loses in a split decision, but finds something far more valuable than a belt. Picking up just after the historic heavyweight bout, Rocky and Apollo are taken to hospital where Apollo challenges Rocky to a rematch, which Rocky declines. Is this serious? Rocky does, however, begin working with an agent to capitalize on his newfound fame and marries Adrian, who soon becomes pregnant. Apollo invests all his energy into goading Rocky out of retirement to face him once more, despite protests from within his camp. He's all wrong for us, baby. After discovering he's a terrible actor and getting laid off from Hall and Beef, Rocky decides he wants to get back into boxing. Adrian and Mickey are against it, but Mickey comes around after Apollo insults Rocky on TV. You gotta eat lightning, you gotta crap thunder. After complications delivering the new baby boy, who they named Robert Jr., Adrian also reveals she's had a change of heart. Win. And Mickey whips Rocky into shape with a much needed montage. <laughs> Fight night arrives and Creed has it all over Rocky, but Rocky won't stay down. Go to him! Run over him! In the final round, Rocky and Apollo both crash to the mat, but Rocky beats the count while Apollo doesn't, making Rocky the new heavyweight champion of the world. Yo, Adrian! I did it! Several years later, Rocky is a wealthy boxing superstar with a string of title defenses to his name. After a farcical charity fight against world wrestling champ Thunderlips, number one contender Clubber Lang calls Rocky out, challenging him to a fight for the title. Rocky accepts against Mickey's advice. This guy is a wrecking machine! Unfortunately for Mickey, he suffers a serious medical episode after a shove from Clubber backstage before the fight. And unfortunately for Rocky, Mickey is right about Clubber, who wins by KO in the second round. Mickey passes away thinking Rocky won the fight, but Rocky is distraught. Apollo offers to train Rocky to fight Clubber again, and his guidance injects Rocky's boxing style with improved speed and footwork. The two become firm friends, cemented surely by this touching beach hug. Clubber and Rocky meet in the rematch, which Rocky wins thanks to his improved skills and standard superhuman resilience. Rocky After earning his belt back, Rocky is living it up once more with his family and his new robot butler. Happy birthday, Bobby. What the hell is this? However, a new fighter has appeared on the circuit, a juiced up Soviet skyscraper named Ivan Drago. He challenges Rocky to a bout, but Apollo takes the fight, a decision that costs Apollo his life. The Russian is indifferent as Apollo dies in Rocky's arms. If he dies, he dies. To avenge Apollo, Rocky challenges Drago to a fight in Moscow, and with the help of Paulie, Adrian, and Apollo's old trainer Duke, he prepares for the fight of his life. Rocky is hammered in the first round, but gets back in the fight after landing a stunning blow late in the second. After taking everything Drago throws at him, Rocky knocks Drago out in the final round, winning over the hostile crowd and defeating communism in the process. Everybody to change. Rocky returns to the States to a hero's welcome, but discovers his crooked accountant has stolen his fortune, and worse, Rocky is diagnosed with brain damage and forced to retire.